cultures again is here so i will be tackling an ig puzzle feed i know guys that you do amazing puzzle feeds in our convax community so i'm so grateful that you are sharing the signs so it's nice to to inspire each other so i just have my own version tutorials for you guys for those who will be asking still how to do ig fossil feed using canva but before that i want you to know the sizes that you can use when you're creating your own puzzle feed okay so if you will be having three posts um three columns in one row you need to have this size 2400 by 800 pixels because because we know id post is 800 by 800 and we just multiply it in the number of posts that we will be having okay for example this one um, our base is always 2-4 because we have 3 columns in Instagram. If you can notice, they are all 2-4 as the base, as a width. But it will just change in how many rows that you will be using when you create your own puzzle fit. So for 3 poses, 3x1, uh, um, 800 pixels for your height. In 6 poses, 1600 because you have 2 rows. For 9 posts, it's 3x3, three three, so it's just the same, 2 4 by 2 4 pixel. Usually, phone, we have 15 posts, which, which is 3 by 5 so we have 2,400 by 4,000 pixels. So those are, are the customized size that you can use when you create uh, IG feed. So this is the split image tool that we will be using when we're done on designing our own ID feed. Okay, so let's start. First, I want you to go in your Canva dashboard and click the customized dimension. So I want to use that nine posts, which is three by three. I will just have it two for here and two for here and create new design. Okay, it is just so simple. You just create your design. Okay. So maybe I can have a background, a plain background here, okay? And then let's go for the photos. I want to female photo. Let's have this and FX is... Let's remove the background. Um, background remover is only available for pro user, for Canva pro user. So let's just wait. Okay, so we can just craft this one like this. And have it here. Then have a text. It's just so simple. Just create your own design. Can just resize it by 144. And okay. What else? Hmm, maybe we can have the sign.
and another one is we can have the grid so we just add new page and have the grids here and elements let's see if we have three by three here there you go so we have three by three here so let's make a copy i want to download this first so let's download it as jpeg Save it here and let's upload it again so we have the same image okay so just dropped it there and make it as big as we, what we have so you have the right size okay let's do let's make the background white so you can see the difference there you go all you can do is just to Resize it according to the size here. Okay, all the square. So you know how it looks like in your feed. Just check if they are match with each other so you can adjust and I think this one is not so this is the A. There you go. So it's perfect. You have the image which you can also add it in your design so uh, how this one will looks like in your Instagram I actually also trying some here and feel free to try you just need to um, play around actually you can have this one just the same you will just have downloaded this JPEG let's see how it works both for page one and page two when we split it in our splitter image so pf2 okay so let's go with the splitter image just need to copy this one and paste it here there you go just upload the photo that you want to split then I have this one and have it split vertically actually both just click the both and horizontally and split the image and then download it one by one to you here so download it and upload it to your IG Once 
tan you can upload it to your IG make sure that you start it here okay and then go here so let's go to the IG again by the way i use downloader for instagram chrome so you can download it to your um desktop so i just have this one then another one let's see how it's look like actually arranged already <laughs> okay just need to upload it all in the same time so you have the right image so you will be starting on row 3 and up to up If you want a little white in this side, maybe you can have the image too. So that's how it's look like on your Instagram feed. So I think that's it. I hope that you learn a lot on, on this video. Um, feel free to be creative on your designs. I know there's a lot of um, good designer in our community. For uh, Thank you for sharing your knowledge, tips, and tricks about how can we make an amazing design so i think that's it um, i hope that you learned a lot on this videos don't forget to like and share because sharing is scary bye